up, it's going down to the last game of the season. Um, it's your main man here, half up, double H, trying to live, trying to exist, trying to stay black, trying to eat my vegetables. The Premiership is going down to the last day of the season. I don't care what anyone says. This is this is not on. A, on I'm not giving my opinion or anything. This is just a cold hard fact. Okay, um, because this is how the Premiership has gone, and I mean Leicester City. Let's. Let's look at the Premier League table, shall we? Premier League table, let's just, let's just review this. So Leicester City, they didn't have their best game against Sunderland, but they got it done. They got it done and they got the, and they got their two Gs from your man, Vardy, who's having a crazy season. So as of right now, Leicester are on 72 points. Tottenham on 65, Aston on 59, because Aston decided that they didn't like winning 2-0, that Aston preferred to do a 3-3. Because, you know, Aston, you know, they, they, you know they, 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 they like to give give teams a, a bit of a chance. So, what's that now? So, that is, so, so there are seven points clear of um, Tottenham. And people assume that it's all over. But I am telling you right now, I've had a vision. I've had a vision. This is, this is going down... To the last day of the season. So this right now. It's going down to the last day of the season. Okay, let's look at your boys' fake fixtures. Um, so Leicester City, West Ham at home. West Ham. That's, that's not easy. Then they've got Swansea, which they should beat, or should they? Should they? United away from home. Yes, United, we know that they they got lubricated and reincarnated and um bap baptized. By three smacks, but I was away from home. Away at Old Trafford, that's a tricky one. Then at home to Everton, then of course the one I believe will be the tricky one. Away at Chelsea. So, for me, I think that um, these are not easy games. People cannot assume that these are easy games for Leicester City. You can't assume this. West Ham are a very good team. Swansea, they may... Um, you know, no, I mean, they may um, be too overconfident. United at Old Trafford is not easy. And United will be trying to get that top four smack. Everton, who knows, they'll be playing for nothing, so they'll have no pressure upon them. So these are not easy games to play. And let's look at what Tottenham have. Um, because, look, I mean, Arsenal, I'm, I'm done with those guys. For Tottenham, what, what do they have? Tottenham have... Okay. Stoke. Okay. Okay. Look, I'll give you that. I'll give you Stoke. I'll give you Stoke. I'll I'll give you Stoke. West Brom. That's is winnable. I mean, I'll get back to Stoke. West Brom is a winnable game. Um, away to Chelsea, that's tough. But I still think that they can beat Chelsea though, because this is a Chelsea team that's not like the Chelsea team of old. So that is a winnable game, and people thought they would lose to United, a team they've not beaten for a long time at White Hart Lane. Um, at home to Southampton. Come on, then away at New Newcastle, and let's talk about Stoke. Tottenham playing the way they are playing. If everybody's on the form, if they play free flowing and attack, Tottenham can beat Stoke. They can beat them if Tottenham play their game and just outplay them and out football them. If they just keep it to football, yes, it's going to be thuggery. Yes, there are going to be some homicides involved, but if they just try their best to keep it to football. They can go out there and they can beat Stoke say, City. They can make it happen. They can make it happen. Um, and I mean, I mean, they can beat West Brom. Chelsea, they can do it because it's not the same Chelsea team. And home to Southampton, away to Newcastle. So when people say Tottenham have a hard run in, uh, I don't know what I mean, boy. Because I'm only seeing two fixtures there possibly. I Stoke away, Chelsea away. Leicester City have West Ham at home, a very good team, and Chelsea away. So, you know, you can argue it for, for both sides. But all I'm saying is this, is that I've had a vision that doesn't include Arsenal. I'm very sorry to, to you Arsenal fans. And my vision is, look at the way the season has gone. This has been easily the most dramatic season in Premiership history, bar none. Since the Premiership was came into play, I believe, in 92 or 93, this has been the most craziest inconsistent dramatic season we've ever had and it is fitting that it goes down to the last day of the season i am not yet my pick is still leicester city i can't change my pick that has been my official pick but i what happened to liverpool has me on the edge 
It's got me on the edge. It's got me on the edge. Because we all assumed, and don't lie. Don't you dare lie. Don't be fake and lie. So, oh, yeah, well, I thought uh, Liverpool were um, no, Liverpool but now is a mess it up here, you know, saving jail. I, I thought it was always going to slip in it. No, you know, you did not. People, everybody, I mean, everybody thought that the way Liverpool were going, they'd win. Yeah, everybody thought it. So, you can't say that. So, I'm mean, assuming crazy things happen in football. We cannot assume anything. Nothing. Could not assume anything. So I just think that this is the letter to City. Okay, this this, this is what, what I say. I think Tottenham will win those those their games. They'll win win their games. Tottenham will win their games. Um I think Leicester will lose to West Ham. 2 1. I think they will pro probably beat Swansea, I suppose maybe 1 0. They will lose to United. So those are two losses. Then at home to Everton and away to Chelsea, those are dicey ones. But I do I think that West Ham will beat them. I really think that West Ham will beat. I think West Ham will go in there and they will do a, a job with them. Especially if let's say West Ham get knocked out by United in the FA Cup. So they're really focused on trying to get that top four crack you know really solidified top six i think Western will go there because they've got something to play for Western have something to to, to to play for so i've just because everybody i've seen on twitter everybody i've spoken to seems convinced that leicester city will win this that they've already won it i think i think that they will win it before the end of the season i don't i'm not, basically i will fully say that it will go down to the last day of the season. I've had a vision and I've seen into the future because I'm Nostradamus. These are, it's, it's my sixth sense. I was, I was born with it with a sixth sense. I can see into the future sometimes. So, and I'm telling you right now, this is a fact. It's going down to the last day of, of the season. And, um, but if Leicester City don't win this premiership, for me, that's, for me, that's un unacceptable. They've come too far. They have come too far for them not to win this. Day. As in for me, I said, like, look, Dope, cheat, do anything you you, you can, but I think because you had Ryan Ranieri crying, man. Okay, you had the, the good old cloud, you the the Tinker Man in tears. So are you gonna really re reject that man in tears? So so I'm speaking to to fate, I'm speaking to fate, right? I'm speaking into to fate because I can't see too far into the the future. If it would be a crime, it would be a crime of all humanity. Even animals bring 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 your ants, rats, ra rabbits, and peacocks into the world. Well, this is world is a family. It would be a crime against all species if Leicester City are not champions. Even if I do feel that Tottenham of all have played the best football, if we're going to say who, who deserves it based on how well they played, is, is it Tottenham? Tottenham have been the most entertaining team this season. But it's but we're dealing with, with math, mathematics. And we're dealing with X's and O's. Um, so, I just do feel that, you know, for just for everything... That Leicester have done in what has been a memorable campaign, they have to be given this Premiership title. In my humble opinion, view. Remember, guys, if you want to talk more, discuss more on the forum. I'm always on the forum, the official forum. You can read it over there. That's how you get into the main forum, halfupfootballhot.boardhost.com, or just Google forum. You will get into the forum, and then we can chat, chit chat. Peace out, stay true, or you can visit the websites or the forum in the description box. It is going down to the last day of the season. Mark my words.